So, in this video, I'm going to show you how to turn a vertical genlek into a horizontal genlek. And obviously, as you can see, the reason why you'd want to do this is because in my situation, you can see that I can push this uh, horizontal way back further, whereas this one kind of awkwardly sticks out. Um, it's very easy to do. You don't need a whole lot of tools or anything like that. You literally, all you need is a 10 millimeter spanner or nut driver ratchet socket whatever you have um you need a number 15 star head or torx whatever you want to call it now <clears throat> with my particular models these are the 61s they actually come with the uh, horizontal bracket that's the vertical bracket over there that i just took off from the uh, the uh, the other model there on the left hand side so you can see it's much bigger and much longer. Now, I do have the uh, the 10s and I also have the 40s. Now, if we have a look here, you can see that there are two, you know, similar screws. But over here we have the, the mounting for them. So I don't know with these particular models if you are able to mount them um, without getting a separate bracket or adapter with the normal isopod uh, stands that come with them but um, with the bigger 61s they do come with the uh, the horizontal mounting plate uh, in the box so again I don't know for the 51s, the 41s, the 31s if they come with the horizontal mounting bracket but again it's very very easy to, uh, to mount them so I'm just going to show that now so now that we have it on its side, obviously you want it on a nice um, squishy surface so you don't damage the enclosure or anything like that. But what you want to do is you want to remove one side of the strap. And you also want to make sure that your button to power it on is actually going to be facing up. So now I come over to this model over here. You can see that the light is on top and the button to switch the unit on is right at the back. Otherwise... You know, it'd be very difficult to go around all the way around to get it underneath to switch it on. So once you have um, the handle removed, I just relocated the handle here. You don't have to have the handle on. You can just take it off altogether. It's not a mandatory or anything like that. And um, you take the two uh, T15 screws out of the standard uh, vertical mount, and you literally just take this uh, bracket out. It's very easy. All you have to do is just push down this tab. And it just slides out and you literally just slide the horizontal bracket in and that's what it needs to look like there and um, you still can tilt it up and down and, um, you know to your desired location it still has all the the same um, movement that you get from the vertical uh, position so you won't lose any um, movement on the uh, isopods so again before we tighten anything in make sure our button it's going to be facing uh, the other side and the stand is going to be facing the other side so we can just easily reach our button and um, this is what it should look like before we tighten in again this is why we removed the uh, the handle because it was in this tread here and we wouldn't be able to, uh, to tighten it in but what you want to do is you want to move everything closest to the base port as far uh, as far as you can so that should look like that and that should look like that before you tighten it in and here's what it should look like. Uh, you don't have to go mad tight with these screws, but just when you're screwing it in, just, I just push my finger over so it gets right on the side. And that's what it needs to look like there. And there's the end result, all finished. Um, obviously I still have to plug in the cables and uh, configure them probably and calibrate them, but that's basically it. Again, I'm sure with the other models, you're able to do the same thing with the standard mounting bracket, this one here. But um, in case you probably have to buy the uh, the horizontal bracket separately, but you'll have to research that on your own particular models. But on these 61s, uh, it comes in the box. So again, I'm not sure for the 51s, the 41s, or the 31s, if they uh, they come with that horizontal bracket in the box. I'm not sure. But yeah, I hope you found this video helpful, and uh, now it's time to enjoy.